It is Thanksgiving, and I have been dry fasting until noon, and I'm about to break my dry fast on raw, unpasteurized grapefruit juice, about 60 ounces of that. Grapefruit juice on a walk in the sunshine on Thanksgiving. And then my love has orange juice. <laughs> Cows. Houses. See the pretty cows? Because this is Texas, and in Texas we have cows right next to houses. Look how beautiful. <laughs> These cows in this backyard are definitely pets. I've seen them for the past year and they are well taken care of. They even made me a baby. I call them tiny. Yard chickens. I'm going to do my main meal of the day right now because we have people coming over. It's Thanksgiving but we're going to play games. Uh, I'm, but I want to have my food prep before before they get here so that they don't have to get distracted by that. It's already done and I don't have to worry about it. So I'm going to spiralize some cucumbers. And here we go. Oodles and oodles of noodles! And now I'm going to let my puppy partake because he loves this part. Come on, sit. He's so good. He loves cucumber. I've got my cucumbers spiralized. Now I can add to that these butternut noodles, which are pre spiralized. Done. And then I'm going to chop my peppers. I'm going to take the seeds out of the middle just because, um, mouthfeel. <laughs> I never thought I would say that, mouthfeel. In they go. Ta -da. I took the liberty of washing all the berries and the tomatoes. So now, I washed them just in the containers, now I'm going to dump them. This is the easiest part. Haha. -ha. Oh! Victoria Everett's sun dried tomatoes. For crunchies. This is the best part when you can just grab and dump. You don't have to prep anything. Onto the dressing, I'm going to peel these and then add five dates and two jalapenos to the blender. All right, we've got mandarins peeled. I'm gonna throw these in here. I always like to put the juiciest item on the bottom so when it starts to blend, it's already there and liquefying. And these don't get stuck in the blades. These are the medjool dates, five of them. And two jalapenos. Because Texas. Twenty seconds in the Vitamix, maybe less. Ooh, it's like cream. Super sweet mandarin date jalapeno cream. And the consistency is thin enough and thick enough to go in and seep through all the cucumber noodles and sort of sit on top. So I think it's just perfect. And that's my main meal of the day. If I get hungry later, I'll probably make something else. And our friends are here, so I'm gonna eat this and we're gonna play games now. Splashed. I could have, especially because one of the vehicles I opened allows me to tap it down. I have taken one of the fire roasted vegetable day cheese pizzas.
I sliced up the remainder of these hickory smoked tofurkey slices. Mm -hmm. Put them on top. Okay. Before I baked it. And now I'm gonna take this vegan stuffing. Vegan holiday stuffing? Vegan holiday stuffing. And we're gonna put it on top. So this is like a Thanksgiving pizza. It's like a Thanksgiving pizza. Oh my god. Thanksgiving pizza. That's brilliant. And well, we'll see. Could be a terrible, terrible decision, but we'll find out. Seems a little overkill. <laughs> Here we go. Time will tell if this is a good idea or a terrible one. Oh, that was a fantastic idea. Actually, <laughs> pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, you, so, you're probably gonna want to cut it here because this is not gonna be pretty. So Thanksgiving stuffing and tofurkey on a pizza. On a pizza. On a day of pizza. On a day of cheese pizza. Wow. I have a history of anxiety on the holidays. It's a big deal where. Thanksgiving, Christmas, birthday, Mother's Day, Father's Day are all huge anxiety days for me. I panic. I used to have panic attacks on those days and the days before and after. And I would self-medicate with alcohol. I would have a lot of alcohol. I would have a lot of food. I would turn myself off emotionally. After I went raw, to cure my multiple sclerosis, that was no longer an option for me. So I had to learn ways to cope that did not involve turning myself off. And it was one of the hardest lessons that I had to deal with in the journey so far, I feel, was battling that urge, that tendency to panic and freak out on any holiday having to do with family. Those are stories for other days though. But I am proud to report that I had no anxiety today, I had no panic attack, and this is just over two years in for Raw for me. I think it is an incredible success, not having that urge and tendency to turn to alcohol and shut myself off and close down and avoid people. I did wonderful today. I spent time with people I care about, my friends and my, my, loved, my loved one, my boyfriend. It was... It was perfect. I'm very proud of what I've done today. I will be sure to put all of my food and the calories and macros in the description of this video so that you can see what all I ate today. I hope you had a wonderful holiday doing whatever it is that you do to celebrate. And I'm gonna go back to the party now. All right, so I'm gonna do a little test here. Just so you can see everything, make sure this is a good angle for you. Very nice. 